welcome in this lecture we are going to understand what is the difference between ground and earth or better to say grounding and earthing if we try to simplify this concept the function of both grounding and earthing is same the only difference is the area of application the first what is earthing earthing means it is a process of protecting the human life or property from unwarranted electrical spike now your question will be how it is protecting see this is our transformer so in transformer all the parts are not live that means suppose this is a window area and if you touch this area then you should not be electrified the only electricity from where you have chances to get shocked is the windings or the connecting points but if there is an insulation failure of the winding if you unknowingly touch those parts then you will get electrified like this so the amount of voltage in transformer may be in kilovolt so if you are getting that much of shock then there is a severe chance of life threat so that has been discussed over here so to protect a human being or any object to get electrified the procedure which is followed is connect this neutral part or parts of the electrical equipment it is not only the transformer but also other electrical equipments from where we have the chances to get shocked are usually connected with the ground so if any kind of current comes to this part of the equipment then that current will simply go to the earth and we will not be get shocked and this type of procedure is called body earthing so you can keep in your memory in like that that whenever you have to earth you have to do a connection between the body of the equipment which is not live or connected with the phase with the earth so that the current get a path to bypass away clear now come to the concept of grounding this is a schematic diagram of a single phase network where this yellow part is phase and the black part is neutral usually what we know current through the neutral wire is always zero because this is a single phase network but if we consider a three phase network then if there are three phases r y and b and current corresponding to these phases are ir iy and ib then we know ir plus iy plus ib is equal to zero so that we say that the current through a neutral wire is always zero but if any situation occurs where due to fault or load unbalance if we get current flowing through this neutral that means in is not equal to zero then people touching this neutral wire get electrified or get shock or this violates the concept of neutral that means the current should always be zero passing through this neutral wire that means there is no current should pass through this neutral wire that is the normal condition so due to this unwanted situation for fault or load unbalance that current that means the neutral current in should go to the 
ground if we connect this neutral to the earth this particular procedure is called neutral grounding so the word grounding is associated with connecting neutral to earth clear so here i am giving you a memory tip just consider two words one is body earthing another is neutral grounding so if you have any confusion between earthing and groundings area of application just think about this two expression that i have given you that is for earthing you have to connect a wire between the body of the equipment to earth and for grounding you have to connect a wire or any connector between the neutral and the earth so in both the cases earth is common only the area of application is different that i have said you at the start of this lecture now here i am showing you a type of earthing this is usually called pipe earthing where the pipe is connected to the earth and any type of unnatural situation the excess current will go to the ground through this pipe there is another type of earthings also one is a plate earthing you can even use a specific swg aluminium wire for earthing solely depends upon the requirement or the network you are working clear i think the entire concept of earthing and grounding is clear to you if you have any confusion please mention in the comment section below thank you